What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. Uh, we're about to get into DDG stepbrother exposed family secrets, core concern. Let's get it. I reported on Corey actually responding to Carmen's You Made Diddy Look Like an Angel. Now, I stated that Carmen's team had Chrissy, this you about to get video blocked. removed. Well, Corey has spoken out about his video being deleted. <laughs> It's like the most funniest shit ever imagined. Everybody talk about you, you trending, and you don't know what being said. You don't know what going on. I'm like, fuck the folks. <laughs> my girl told me I can't get on with social media. She took all my shit. I was like, I don't have no Instagram, no Twitter, no Snapchat, no Facebook. I barely can have YouTube. She wouldn't even let me get on YouTube. But I had to drop my video. Uh -uh. My video got deleted. I had to drop my video. It got deleted. They got my video. I don't know if all of y'all tapped into my Patreon, but if you're not, tap in right now. I'm about to, to put the link in the pinned comment. Like everybody ever got to this video. Now they wanna they wanna block mine because mine is supposed to be true. Nah. So I'm fighting. So if it, if it get deleted again or everybody dies, like I watch you really don't give a fuck. Anyway it is, I'm not gonna keep on addressing lies. It's dead. I'm moving on in life. I promise y'all. Hey, play on. Mm -mm. Hella bands. I bet you might be one of the Hella bands. You know that song, Hella bands? H E L L A B A N D Z. Give me that juice. I really don't need that. That Wilch. Hey, y'all. Um, I just put the Patreon in the pinned comment. All of Corey's. Uh, well, Corey's video, his full video, and Carmen's full bit video. I reacted to it. Y'all make sure y'all check it out. Um, some things that's copyrighted, I put on there. I react to the baddies. I react to um, the aunties. I just posted both new episodes uh, as well. And we about to, I'm about to start spamming y'all with uh, police content. Just, just a lot. And let me know specifically what y'all want me to react to specifically. I would love to know so I can provide it, okay? But tap into the Patreon. I react to copyrighted content on there. Come fuck with me. It's only 16 cents a day. You know what I'm saying? Come out about $5 and some change a month, all right? Nah, you bored. Especially if y'all bored tonight. I got Crazy in Love on there, Krishan, Blueface, all that. It's, I got a lot of videos for y'all to watch if y'all bored tonight. <laughs> Okay, what are we doing? Me versus me, one of my legs. Baby, can you help me? Baby, can you help me? Baby, can you help me? My head hurts. Y'all think Corey soda can or essential bottle? I'm trying to get my life together, please. Huh? You should too. I think he in between. He gives in between. Not, uh, yeah. Yeah. About right. Because you got to think I've been wearing long socks and doing all the time. So my socks go cover up the flames a little bit. So I go. Rest in peace to Sonya Massey. I will not be talking about that. Um, and let me just put this out there because a lot of people forget. When it comes to that type of content, I'm... I have a very soft spirit and death is just not something that I like to speak about, especially in that magnitude. I can't do it. It brings a different type of stress and darkness to me. I can't do it. I don't even see how y'all watch it. I didn't watch it and I ain't watching it. Okay. So I'm just letting y'all know that that one right there. I can't do it. Rest in peace. So now I also spoke previously about this whole situation with DDG's older sister Tawana and Dub's ex-girlfriend slash baby mama Brittany. Now they've always had a troubling past and as of recently since Dub has broken up with Brittany, Tawana has found this the time to start throwing a lot of shade. Now the other day she mentioned something about her and just recently on DDG's mom's Snapchat she stated this. Oh, that was your baby. Hi, ah, you cross at it. Yes, you are. <laughs> Who I look like? <laughs> so DDG's mom was in the background talking about the 
I look like? Yes, you are. Who I look like? What did she say? Yes, you are. Who I look like? That don't sound like Britney. Who I look like? What did the girl say? Shit, that don't sound like Britney. Yes, you are. <laughs> Y'all heard the who I look like. What did the girl say after that? Who I look like? I, I didn't hear Britney, but. So DDG's mom was in the background talking about the dog, stating that the dog is cross-eyed. Then Tawana threw in who I look like. And you can see how DDG's mom responded to that. Now, speaking on Mama DDG, her boyfriend, Wave Cap George's son, dropped a video. Now, in this video, he was speaking about his father. Although he wasn't speaking negative, he was speaking on some events that occurred after his mother passed away and George was out living his life in Los Angeles with DDG's mom. Now, after everyone started going off on George in the comments, his son then deleted the video. As you can see here, the video has been removed by the uploader. The video was titled, How's life been with my dad not around? Now, then he posted a video trying to- Why didn't he bring his son with him? Clear everything up and people in the comment section weren't there for it. They were stating, no matter how much George provided financially, when your mom died, George was supposed to step up and finish raising you, not put you off on others. I'm pretty sure Tanya, AKA Mama DDG, wouldn't mind having him in her house to assist George in raising his minor child. Ah, uh, cause if that's the case, she would have. Cause I wouldn't be, it wouldn't sit right with me that she ain't taking care of him or he ain't taking care of him. And he got to make this video. I mean, y'all didn't take care of him. Since George was already living there. No, George isn't a bad guy. But I think the situation could have been handled way different. Then another person commented, nah, why would you delete that video? Would have boosted your career and it's the truth. I can tell you got paid or something. You wild for that. Now he responds with, YouTube hate when I speak the truth. So they took it down along with some other videos. Shaking my head. It's all love though. Everything I do is for y'all. I don't care about the money. Now we know YouTube didn't take that video down because it would have stated that it was blocked or something that clearly Definitely stated said that. the uploader removed the video. Well, like I stated, he did another video this time, including George in it, where George was speaking, stating that he didn't think his son was trying to throw him under the bus. And would mama DDG actually stay with the man that was a deadbeat father? Do you think if I was that type of, if I mistreated my kids like that, that Tanya would allow me to be around, be with her? Yo, that's what I'm saying. Like she. Well, well why is he not there? Or, or well, I I don't even know how old he is now. So like come on now. Woman, what would a why would a great woman be with a deadbeat ass nigga? Literally. Make that make sense. Make that make sense, y'all. Explain that. that. Come on. Erica, I'm with you, baby. What I'm in the not comments. Y'all gotta reimburse yourself with some new knowledge down in the comments. A great woman would not accept a deadbeat. My fact, stay with a deadbeat as long as she stayed with me. You know what I mean? And when she seen that, come on, man, y'all, y'all talking about her man. She ain't like that. Like, stop that. She don't get on. We don't. I don't get on no social media to talk about anybody because that's. Patty is, 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 is vicious. So now you guys leave your opinions on this down in the comment section below. I've seen a lot of people stating that, of course, he's going to stay with DDG's mom and he's not going to want to leave and he's not going to want to bring any of his kids into her home because it may start some confusion or something there. But either way, one of his kids' moms died oh, and 18. he didn't go get his son and move him to LA like people would have thought that he would have done. And if I'm not mistaken, George has about six other kids. But anyways, you guys leave your opinions on this situation down in the comment section below. But his son also had this to say about his father. There's some junk and it came off wrong. It's not like that, bro. It's not like that. I said I was away, he been away for like a year and a half or I might've said something 
okay it wasn't like a year and a half but it was like you know a little bit of time but in that little time we still talking how he is he's still you know probably sending me money for something i need doing whatever it is i need whatever boom how i'm doing you feel me helping him out it's never no dead b wave cap it's never no he don't want to see his son wave cap y'all all it is is just he got a wife he got a person that he got to take care of while he's taking care i hate your shirt care of me if i was there then I wouldn't be recording these videos. Like I, I hate that bonnet. <laughs> it's pissing me off. I'm gonna be explaining in that video how I explained it, cause then I'll be explaining it right next to him, or just in a different way. But since I'm here handling my business, doing what I gotta do here, and while he there doing what he gotta do with his wife and talking to me, you know, talking to his kids, cause he's still in connection with all his kids. Like it's not, it's not none of that. Nigga, we ain't even know he had kids. <clears throat> but y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I'm done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.